Nama saya Wilid, um, saya VP of Growth at Freelancer.com Saya asalnya dari Indonesia, uh, saya pindah ke um, Australia pas uh, 15 tahun uh, Saya sudah bekerja selama satu setengah tahun di, uh, di Freelancer.com So Freelancer.com is the largest outsourcing marketplace It, you know, we essentially have 7 million users now, uh, where about f over 4 million users are freelancers and you know, the, uh, the rest of them are employers. Uh, so we are essentially eBay of services where people from mostly developed countries will post projects and uh, people from developing countries you know, will be able to bid on those projects. And then uh, essentially the bid will be uh, a lot lower had you done it locally in those developed countries. So you know, as I said, um, you know, websites Websites design or website creation would easily cost two thousand dollars US if you have done it in Australia. Whereas you know, if you have done, if you if you actually outsource it to India or Malaysia or Philippines, you know, it would have been two hundred dollars easily. So you know, you save about ninety percent of the cost. Yeah. So essentially, we connect. You know, we essentially provide the bridge between the developed countries mostly to developing countries, and you know, we provide the, the bridge to our untapped pool of talents. Okay, so this is only a step one where we are. Uh, we will support Malaysia Reggae uh, in terms of the payments. Uh, step two, you know, we totally change, um, which is uh, we'll hire uh, local country managers. We'll hire, we'll have a support or concierge team, customer service team that can speak Malay or and both Malay and English uh, is familiar with the with the local customization features as well. So those are the big two things that we are working on at the moment as we speak. You could specify which currencies you want it to be. Uh, most of the projects are. Are currently in US uh, as we haven't, you know, as this is only the first step to uh, to expose that into Malaysian market. But as we, you know, as it progresses, uh, we will be expecting more and more proportion of uh, uh, projects in Malaysian currencies and also projects that require only local local Malaysians to be able to be on the projects. I think um, you know Malaysians uh, freelancers are really uh, top of the class. Um, I actually scanned through a few freelancers on my own uh, from Malaysia. Um, the top, you know, the top guy earns uh, up to hundred thousand dollars. The second top guy earns up to fifty thousand uh, dollars in a year. So you know, the, the freelancers in Malaysia definitely have the skills and uh, you know, and the quality to, uh, I guess, essentially be able to compete with the other countries. We are currently at fifty thousand, and we're expecting hundred thousand by the end of this year, and hopefully three hundred thousand by the end of next year. So it's very promising. Um, you know, clearly this is one of the first steps that we have done, and. Uh, uh, online marketing is definitely online acquisitions is definitely the big key as well that we think will be will be power will be powerful in order to um, you know, achieve that target, and uh, we will try to target our young you know, graduates as well by uh, essentially you know, through online channels of course because it's a very scalable way to acquire users. Similarly, uh, we we are expecting about up to uh, three million dollars by the end of this year, so you know that that would be essentially our target and to see whether the launch has been successful or not. I, I mean, I mean the fact that I don't see a lot of difference between you know freelancers from other countries and Malaysia, so that is a good thing, meaning uh, there's no sort of big gap between uh, you know, our major freelancers, for example, from India or Philippines, you know, who are majorly English-speaking countries, but you know, because Malaysia is one of the English-speaking countries as well, so I, don't, I wouldn't see any problem in terms of winning the job. I mean, ideally, because there are only 50,000, sorry, because there are only 43,000 freelancers, that's why you know, the job exposure is not that much yet, but you know, I would see them being able to compete with the other freelancers easily. I, I think it's the next big thing, you know, like, um, it is essentially going to change the world. You know, we provide this platform for small to medium entrepreneurs that wouldn't be able to outsource their jobs otherwise, and now they're saving you know, hundreds, hundreds of dollars you know, to achieve the same job. And you know, this is going to be the next big thing because outsourcing has always been available for big, com big companies, but not to smaller companies like you know, small to medium entrepreneurs. Um, and you know, five billion people are yet to connect to the internet. Uh, most of them, when they come to the internet, I mean, the first thing they like to look for is to raise their economic status. And freelancer.com provides a platform for those freelancers to be able to do that. So we have five, you know, essentially, we have five billion potential customers. There. My my hope is essentially you know, very similar to all the people as well, which is if you have an idea, you know, for, from an entrepreneur's perspective, if you have an idea, you should turn that into a reality. And you know, there's never been an easier time to start a company. You know, you, you know, you, you may not know the technical part of making a website, but you know, freelancers at freelancer.com will be able to do all those for you. In the meantime, if you have the trade, you know, you should be going to freelancer.com to find those jobs. Right? 
right? Average job is like $200. So if you do three of those every month, you'll be set.